to standards that I want, running a business, working part-time job, and have goals for this thing to put bolt-ons on it, like coal air intake, um, headers, and lowering springs and stuff like that. Um, what else? Uh, maybe one day turbos, twin turbos. But I wanted to come on here and talk about what's my goal for the YouTube channel. Still do YouTube part time, like for a hobby, and see where the channel grows and stuff. Because one, um, sorry, I haven't done too much. My subscribers are going down, but I said to, it's hard when you start back to work, you have to figure out your schedule to do things that you want to do for life, like hobbies and stuff, because one, when you work part time and then work at a farm as well, and get things done try to get things done for your business as well as your work you have to think of things and catch up on sleep as well because one I'm going I'm going to sleep at a certain time at night and like I go to bed early uh, 10 o'clock at night because when I'm whooped because I'm up really early in the morning to go to work and then when I come home I have to do other things and try if I have customers for example I try to get them done as well that's why I'm always tired trying to get things done trying to make sure my cars my car looks nice and Dutch. my dad's truck trying to promote my business as well to get uh, customers because one I don't want to be working part-time I would like to have a part-time and do my business as well to make extra income it would be an awesome thing to do that I enjoy doing what I'm doing so far and but tell, tell them I'm going to teach Derek how to do editing. And then, then I'm going to teach Derek how to do editing sometime in the near future or soon to get him proper to make my our YouTube keep uploading if I can't do it while I'm working and stuff. Because one, I really want to keep doing Honda vlogs and other kinds of vlogs as well. Dog, or, uh, and my dad's truck do videos on that. Plus I have videos that I, or mods that I want to do to this and stuff. I want to do a lot of things in my life. I have one goal that I'm uh, compared are trying to get going and get customers and stuff to help me out and make a little bit more extra income to help me out do modifications to my car and maybe another project car someday because my ultimate project car I want a Datsun 510 or an EG hatch because I love Hondas I love the older cars and stuff, but if I can get that and stuff, then I'll be a proud of what I accomplish in my life. Because my life, I want to do things that I want to do. My goal is to have a Datsun 510 one day and put the dream motor in, in it, like a 2JZ motor or a 1J don't know for sure 
Um, what else? I really want to do things that I want to do. Put the, fix this car up and do, and put it in car shows and stuff like that to be happy and stuff. I really enjoy doing things with vehicles and new things and I want to learn how to drive a standard better to make my life more fun. I know how to drive a standard but I haven't driven it on the road because I want to get confident to do it by myself by myself without someone showing me what to do. I know I know how to drive a manual, but two cars that I've driven where the clutches were awkward or the clutch were going out means the clutch was done and I didn't like the feeling of it. Plus one thing that I um, want to do as well if I have the money and saved up, I want to help my uncle out with, um, help him out what stuff he wants. I want to learn, get him new technology for the farm and stuff. Because one, he doesn't always want to be staying, um, at the farm. At the farm, he wants to do more things, but he can't do that if he um, has what is it called? To work all the time. Work all the time. What, what the, the hell? Sorry, our language. Sorry, someone cut me off in front of my ca car. Um, like help him out do things that he needs to do and then one thing the car in front of me when I'm driving he pulled out in the middle of the lane to turn and it made me press on the brakes because he was coming right at me one thing when you're driving you don't do that kind of stuff because one I've had experience before that someone cut me off almost ran into me while heading home from work and it was a scary situation when you had a long day at work and you don't want you want to just get home not have a scare of your life that's one thing I hate uh, where I live in a small town that some people's some people don't know how to drive. I know how to drive, but it's a situation that people got to learn to learn how to um, drive carefully because one, some people are new drivers, I understand that, or old drivers, but sorry about the rant, but don't cut people off to make um, a turn. Make your proper turn and stuff. Because one, that makes other drivers uncomfortable what they're doing or want to do. And the guy in front of us, he's in a rush to go nowhere. Yes. I'm not in a rush to go anywhere. I'm doing the speed limits. A little bit over the speed limit, but it's 9.90 here. Yeah. But, I'm just saying, I'm sorry off the topic of the different topic that I was talking, but some drivers need to pay attention because one, it makes no sense to make a damn turn. Go in the center lines and turn. Wait until the trap car passes, then make your turn. But some people don't understand that or don't know how to do that. But back to the other topic that my uncle wants to have robots. I'm looking into the robot or he's looking into robots.
robots, but I don't think that they're 250000 a piece, and he doesn't want to spend that kind of money, because one, he, he would, but not right now. He doesn't know if the, it's going to make good production on their milk, but you have to make, you have to see, because I don't know how long the robot milkers have been out for, but he wants to see what kind of um, production they produce first, like how many, how much liters they produce, or how much liters they can hold, and then see what happens see what if they can keep up with us like if they can get it done in an hour and a half like me and my uncle can get it done in an hour and a half milking but I wanted this he wants to see if they can match that because if you're because my uncle's milking 85 heads of cow and he wants to know he wanted to know once to look that up that or he's looking that up to see if the production they can get that done in record time then we don't have to do it by hand all the time but it's a situation that um, you have to look into and stuff but I hopefully that you enjoyed the video I hope that you understand that I've been busy a little while that I haven't made no videos I am working now running a business plus you have to find time to sleep but I'm giving this point that I want to do more Honda vlogs and more truck vlogs and stuff but I hopefully that you enjoyed the video. Please comment down below and subscribe. And don't let people bring you down. And, and have an awesome rest of your day. And do your dream. Your dreams will come true. Bye.